Hello, hi everyone. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Kayla Black and if you're new to this channel, welcome, welcome. So, as the title suggests, today I will be talking about my favorite cleansers that I've used so far and I'm loving like, it's my current fave, you know? And I'm really into products and stuff like that, so this is what I'm loving at the moment. Uh, I'll be splitting my um, cleansers into foam cleansers and cream cleansers. So yeah, if you have dry combination skin and you want to know what's on the market, what's good, what's not good, and what's the thing, like on skincare, I'm here to tell you what my favorites are. I'm not a person that is necessarily into a brand, say if it's natural or if it's uh, like geared towards like cruelty free or anything like that. Like I like products like that, but I still will give a product a go, like a try, even if it's not in those vegan, natural type of categories. So yeah, and I, I like to give all products a chance. So without further ado, let's hop right into the video. Alright, so the first one on my list, I would have to say, I don't really have a first, I just like all of them to be honest, like I have different ones for them. So for my foam cleansers, my hand is done, the Clinique, you guys know I love the Clinique, I mentioned this in a video already, I think it was my skincare review video of my skincare products and my simple yeah so let's just start off with the clinic like you guys I did a review on it already like you should know how I feel about this like it lathers it doesn't strip your skin your skin don't feel like cardboard after you finish washing like your skin it feels smooth when you apply it on like the rinse off like it smells like pretty neutral and basic like it's mild so I'm guessing that means like sensitive skin or whatnot like you guys know how I feel about this already let's just go on to the next foam cleanser so my next foam cleanser is this one come to a shock to me this is a shock this is my simple oh my god it's the focusing simple my simple refreshing facial wash 100% soap free and it's for like sensitive skin I literally did not know I would like this product I've tried some products before but because it's like everywhere I'm like mm, I don't like come on phone things so I was like I don't know but I was like feeling exotic that day and it was like literally one pound fifty or two pounds so I'm like I'm gonna try it and it says sensitive skin and like it has no artificial perfumes no colors no harsh chemicals to upset your skin no alcohol no soap no mineral oils all of that it doesn't have so I'm like all right I'm just gonna give it a go listen when I come warm I wash my face I'm like oh my god this this literally shocked me like I would have never thought that a drugstore product could make my face like wash that great like what am I even saying that is not even English like <laughs> this it surprised me when you put it on it's silky it's smooth and when you wash it off like your face is not stripped off like like feeling like dry and like choppy like it, it's a go-to I'm not gonna lie like this is one of them products you could just take it up go like fill it up in your travel size stuff like yeah it's just one of them ones that do their job and I I really like it I really like it I'm not gonna lie I think probably I will always have this in my cupboard in my bathroom I'm not gonna lie <laughs> it's really I'm very surprised at that. 
I'm very surprised. I, I'm, I'm really surprised. And as it pertains to ingredients, like as I said, it has none of the whole nasty nasties. So like, yeah, simple. You did a great one with that one. Yeah. So these are the two. <laughs> so yeah. These my gosh, what happened to me today? I will have just a drop drop things. Yeah, so these are the foam cleansers that I currently like. Oh, I didn't notice they're in the same color. Look at that coincidence. So these are the two foam cleansers that I'm currently loving. And yeah, I'm on the hunt for other cleansers because you all know I don't like products. So I'm gonna find other products out there that is good for dry combination skin or normal skin i don't necessarily i can probably look for something for oily skin but i don't really have oily skin so probably it's best like not to like i don't really buy stuff for oily skin but i buy products that are for normal dry combination or all types of skin types so oily people out there I can still hook you up because there's some products that are just universal. Yeah, so on to my cream cleansers. Cream cleansers I usually use in the morning time because I don't want to strip my face off too much and I don't want to have that oh, cardboard face in the morning. I want to add nourishment and moisture to my skin in the morning. So I usually use foam cleansers foam cleansers in the nighttime to like you know get that thorough clean although these foam cleansers don't necessarily leave your skin stripped and dry they still get down and dirty to get the gunk out if you know what I mean yeah so yeah for morning time why is everything falling I don't really know but yeah so for morning time I use the Ordinary Squalene, yeah, and I've talked about this in my The Ordinary video already, so you guys know how I feel about this already, because I rated it and everything. If you want to go check out that video, I'll put it somewhere up there, you know, as a card, and you can go watch what I said about the Squalene Cleanser. Yeah, so yeah, but you know I like it already, it's in my favorites video, so of course I like it. <laughs> Onto the one that Mama cut by mistake. This one is the Florence by Mills Clean Magic Face Wash. It is like a face wash. It's a brand that's cruelty free and vegan. Like I don't judge. Like I use all ranges of products. Uh, the point I'm at in my life right now, I'm not really like oh I'm gonna use only cruelty free and vegan products or I'm gonna only use like natural products or I'm only gonna use like chemical products like I don't really I'm not biased when it comes to products I'll give every product a chance as I said right now where I'm at in my life so yeah this is the Florence clean magic face wash it says it's supposed to remove makeup and stuff but I've never actually tried it like that as a makeup remover I always use it as like just a face wash in the morning and trust me honey this is a moisture balm when you put it on your face feels so nice when you wash it off <sighs> not gonna lie I think I like this one better than this one the, the, the ordinary one but like this one man Mm. The only problem I have with it is very cold. When you put it in the eye, like, what oh, Jesus? Ooh. It's very cold. See something wrong with me today. I'm falling, everything is falling. Yeah, so that's the only issue I have with this product. It's just really cold when you're putting it onto your skin. I'm wondering if that's the reason why they use this packaging. or is the formulation or something because people have skincare fridges and they use like cold products on their face probably i'll get into that when i'm rich <laughs> mm. so yeah i really like this product the 
ingredients are clean like actually the ingredients are not on here but they're on the box but I can tell you that the ingredients are clean and yeah it's vegan it's cruelty free and it's a I recommend I recommend this Florence clean magic thing like it works it works for me at least yeah and those are the four cleansers that I'm loving on right now like in the future I'm gonna find more and I'll share it with you while I'm about the love side oh my gosh man yeah so in the future I'll share my discoveries of my nice cleansers but basically what I look for in a cleanser I don't want anything that strip my face I don't want anything that will make me feel dry I want something that will make me feel hydrated and moisturized whether it's a foam cleanser or a, a cream cleanser like that is what I look for because I have a dry combo skin and I need that extra moisture so if you are a person that likes them types of cleansers like you can consider subscribing to my channel because this is the products that I look for when I'm looking for like I love hydration I, not right now I have pigmentation that I'm trying to get rid of yeah and I'm gonna find the remedy like I cleared my skin from pizza face so I can clear my skin to absolute clarity and I'm on my journey to find the best and most cost-effective products because I don't got a million dollars to spend on products but yeah thank you thank you thank you so much for watching my video and if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up to let me know that you liked my video and YouTube to know too y'all want YouTube to know just click that like button and let it glow with the blue thing you know and I'll know that you liked it and what I would be really interested in if you guys could just comment down below what cleansers you like and probably I'll look it up like well most likely I'm gonna look it up because I like products I'll look for it and then I'll see like hmm, I probably like it too so I might buy it and then I'll probably do a review on it or whatever but I would really really be interested in to see like what people are liking and all of that like yeah don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on your post notifications so you can know every time I upload a video because you don't want to miss none of anything I have to say. Yep, and I guess that's it for this video. Yeah, I'll see you in the next one.